Hey guys, welcome back to the farm. Fun video today. We're gonna dig up this tree. Simple as that. Let's have at it. So we're gonna see how this goes. Just a little uh, coyote backhoe. First tree. So, most important thing with digging up a tree is patience. This is going to take a while. Probably going to have to move the tractor a couple times. You're going to have to just dig a pretty big hole depending on the size of the tree. So I'm just spreading this stuff out. And we're going to start digging. See what we come up with. Which by the sounds of it, might be rocks. So if you hit a root, you don't want to force it through it. You kind of want to move out to where the root's a little thinner and then start grabbing it from there. I'm going to dig out a little bit more here. I can't pop that root. I got it. I'm gonna get in a little closer and try and do it just so I can get some of the weight of the dirt off. Rock. around. Get a little 
love tap huh? So catching over here, so let's go after this now. You also want to make sure you watch out for your hydraulic lines. over here start digging at it through the rock Lot of rocks in here. Got one of them. that root that was causing the problems. Now I can dig in there. So just about working it slowly, being patient. You don't want to put any stress on your machine. So sometimes you got to dig a little bit bigger hole and it is what it is. rock. All right, so video abruptly 
stopped. I looked back in my cab and saw a check engine light on. Yep. So 48 hours on the machine, 47, something like that. And the check engine light comes on. So I stopped, contacted the dealer, waited for them to get back to me on what the error code was. And it is something to do with the fuel injection and the regen system. So they advised me not to run it anymore. So I am not doing that. Just had to move it away. Just got bombed by a bird. Just had to move it out of the way from where it was and get a few things out of the driveway. Uh, when I turned it back on, the check engine light was not on. Um, so I might have ran it another half hour or hour, something like that. Um, seems to be doing okay. No more check engine light. But they're going to pick it up Friday, take it in, hook it up to the computer, and see what's wrong with it. Bad news is, without exactly knowing what's wrong, they, you know, can't really tell me how long it'll take to fix. Um, last time it was in the shop, it was in for a while for the air conditioner due to not being able to get a part. So we're kind of at their mercy with getting it fixed. Hopefully it'll be quick. Check engine light on, under 50 hours, not exactly something you, digging up the tree is going to have to wait until we get the tractor back, along with everything else here on the farm. If I'm not posting any videos for a bit, you understand why. <sighs> so, we'll see you on the farm next time.